You ready? Let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Clifford Jackson. Uh, he is our driver of the month. Uh, I remember when Clifford started, he hit the ground running. He was great with communication, holding drive time, safety conscious, and looking ahead with all of his plans. I can always count on Clifford to call, or if he can't call, he at least messages about any issues that come up. If it's a shop or safety issue, he's on the phone with them first, and then he gets all of me to let me know what's going on and make sure the full range of communication is there. For any customer issues, he's on the ball right away, getting a hold of me or someone else if he can't get a hold of me. Um, to make sure that we are aware of the issue for that customer or any pre-plans because he's aware of how things domino. Uh, he only stops when needed as he just loves to go, but he's good about logging all the required on and off duty time that our drivers need to show. Uh, he always kills the slowest as he does his best to make sure he's not putting himself in a position that could uh, violate his logs or any other DOT issue. Uh, he is great about using an atlas and comparing it against the GPS and making sure he's staying on legal routes for where he's going. Um, I've had many conversations with him when we're talking about routes and I can hear him turn the page on the Atlas and he's got the GPS up there so I can know for sure he's actually doing things the correct way. Um, but the thing I most appreciate most about Clifford uh, is his positivity and sense of humor. You can see you can't stop laughing sometimes. Um, as uh, uh, he is great about making light of any stressful situations uh, just finding a way to laugh about it. Uh, for example, he helped us rescue a truck out of Memphis, Tennessee a few weeks ago. And if you're not aware, rescuing a truck can be a very stressful ordeal. And Clifford just laughed the whole way like, well, you won't guess this issue. Ah, oh, well, this issue too. So he just finds ways to laugh about everything. Um, and even on the rare occasion, um, he can't reach me about whatever's going on. He doesn't get mad. All he does is give me a hard time with the fact he can't reach me. So he'll complain that Lee has to take his call instead of me because, uh, yeah, he's just... Jason's answering. Yeah, thank you, Lee. I appreciate the support. Um, on top of all that, Clifford does seek out opportunities to help other drivers on the way, our drivers, other truck drivers, uh, just to see if they need help or training. And he does his best. He gives out his phone number to help others, just trying to make uh, friends along the way. Um, his total miles for the month of September were 9,942 as well. So Clifford is able to do all this and keep up uh, all of his miles and deliver all those for us. And for all these re reasons, Clifford, that you are September driver of the, or excuse me, August driver of the month. Sorry. <laughs> I do want to thank Westside Transfer for allowing me to be in a family and his family. I've been a truck driver for over 22 years, but I believe the best company that I have been with is this company here. Uh, I, I've talked to a lot of dispatchers, and like he said, I don't get mad. You know, he might get mad at me, but I just, you know, he'll text me back and say, I apologize. I said, whatever, old man. You know, <laughs> but this is how I believe that a driver should communicate with their dispatchers with a smile no matter what the situation is. Cause nobody's perfect. We all make mistakes. We all make mistakes out there. But I just want to thank y'all and thank you for this. And I love this guy so much. And I be calling him my dad sometime. And even though I'm 63 years old, he <laughs> but, uh, uh, I just want to thank Mr. Don. It's nice to meet you today. I found out you're the owner. And even though you're a Dallas Cowboy fan, but um, I am. Uh, <laughs> But uh, I, I do appreciate this, and thank y'all so much. Thank you.